All right, Happy New Year. J. Cole's Project One is the name of the map. Let's start with the obvious. T spawn very empty. I can't speculate on much. I, uh, this is re-recording. I'm trying to make everything nice and concise. So let's start speed running through the bullet points. Um, T spawn. Introduce some sort of slope. That is very fun. Players are naturally pushed into the level by the level geometry. You know, the map is like telling you go this way. You don't want to run up the hill, right? That's exhausting. Also, it can result in like funny accidental run boosts, which also give you a timing advantage. And you can definitely like gamify those. But I think like those like fan funny accidents are always worth the, the effort making it, right? Um, this is very empty as well. Like couple stimulants, gray box stimulants, maybe like some sort of a funny meme, <laughs> you know, or something to jump off, maybe a surf. Um, okay, let's get to the real stuff that's interesting with this map very j cole-esque having uh the mid rotations like in your mind when you think about mid what it what it means really it's a path of uh of rotation or like an area that you can rotate area that you can control to control the rotations over um here this map does rotations very interestingly as t side we have left side mid and then we have right side corridor that connects up in CT spawn. CT spawn is over there. This is CT spawn extended. CT spawn can split into two, and then you have very interesting fights. In order for terrorists to be able to uh, rotate at all, they have to get on, get this area under control and actually get to the both sides of the vent. Uh, I wouldn't, I, this is like very harsh speculation. I would already say that like not being able to rotate one on, on, on your own from this side to the vent. I think that's going to be kind of an oversight when it comes to players like ability to do anything in the map. Uh, you're not always going to have your buddy here. Even if you, if you have five players alive, just getting into this position with two, two players every round, it's probably too much asked. Um, here, I'd say that this is like way more plausible. Um, my suggestion also, if you think about the rotations, you're Starting your starting point is like over here outside A. Um, let's say that some situation comes where you cannot rotate there and you have to rotate back. You can fall back into the vent, right? You go all the way here. And now you come out of here. And now you're back at long. This means that this map has same sort of a rotation that Inferno has. So what you have to do in order to maintain some sort of a uh, rotation control, you have to split long up into parts of control as a terrorist, much like Inferno on T side. Inferno's, Inferno is a very challenging map and it can be very CT sided on low skill levels where, you, where utility is not given uh, in the same way that it's obvious for like higher rank uh, and higher skill players where they like realize oh right if I mol if I molly this now cities cannot necessarily push this or if I smoke up here now I can push up I can be anywhere behind the smoke as close to the bomb side as I want right um, this is fine and we can we can see how this play plays. But in order, or like my suggestion to make this a little bit, a little bit more spicy, is to introduce another path here. Make this path closer to the T spawn, so there's an actual entrance to this map, or like this area with with faster terrorist timings. I know you have to have this, like this path has to exist here, so that it makes sense for the timings, and also is close enough to the bomb site. But you don't have to have that. You can push this back to be over here, so the terrorists get into this con uh, corridor earlier. And you can introduce another path from here through here. This will have a major effect on how the map will play. As in, now counter-terrorists can smoke far like this, and now they can push up into the corridor. Whilst, from CT spawn, I'm not going to walk this, this is boring. Uh... You can now smoke up to this, 
and you can actually play inside of the room having this little strip here does the exact th same thing as like this whole room this could be under terrorist control but this area could be under city control and now there's still a way to go back to t-spawn and take the long route completely bypass this and get to the bomb site and this player will always have something to do he always has the risk of getting flanked if one of these rooms are not under control and i think that's just so much more interesting this long gets already three ways that you can play two ways you can play on both sides when it comes to the map map control side of things and it's a no man's land more than it would be right now right now it's just you smoke up here and you play up close like like this and that's it t side you smoke up here and now you can get a little bit closer like this and you can maintain some sort of control if you have like three smokes per round by your t t uh, by your teammates and i think like this is fine as a as a, as a concept but we already have uh inferno that does that dynamic like so well so without adding anything to like playing off of the inferno uh structure doesn't doesn't necessarily make sense to me to reinvent the wheel um a bomb site i'm not going to talk of the, of the bomb sites that much they, they look to be very standard they both both have heaven and main they are actually like almost like carbon copies of each other um yeah not much to add but just the rotation control it's again very interesting uh and i'm going to link all the j cole map playtests into the description of this map so you can for yourself you can see the the kind of feedback that people give to it to, to his uh, his creations which is like very interesting um and my, my feedback definitely has, has stayed quite the same throughout the versions i'm not sure if i've already went through this this is this is my second take uh cd spawn this angle is very long could you do something about it adding a box in the in the way and also if you think that the city is like spawn too close to the box and it's like clutter uh spawn them further away <laughs> i think i think that's that's a good fix here there was a little gap that should be fixed <clears throat> there are also tons of little micro gaps between these boxes you cannot shoot that shoot through that either so that's a huge issue here as well all the all these like dust to stack the boxes have that same same error also here you can probably get some information about that or through that unintentionally uh and lastly the nuke truck you can see through the 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 under the under the truck but you cannot shoot through it which is weird but yeah i like the how the map is laid out already I would probably deem it a little bit more interesting if there was like a little bit more chaos happening around here and more CT and T control switching hands. Um, but I like the vent. I love vents and vents allow you to have very dramatic coloring and like shape shadows and interesting reflections. Ooh, would that be abused? Yeah. Also remember to build your, your cube maps. For a gray boxing, have like one cube map plus light probe volume. Have it like over here. Put the cube map in a very well lit area if that's what you want for the reflections to have. Very well lit. And then just stretch the whole cube map volume. Like light light probe volume with having the cube map means in here. That's that's good enough. Remember to build them. And also when you're compiling, put the tab on auto generate cube maps on, on map load or whatever. Put that to on so that you will get fixed cube maps that's about it yeah this looks interesting the map, map could be also like a little bit squished in like in like this way you know like look at my cursor like here and here if this mid is like kind of wide you have some uh, quite a lot of dead space here and see this one is a bit too long i think like you can cut off some space from here 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 yeah that's about it thanks for watching take care and have a good rest of your year right don't blow your fingers off okay stay safe